What's going on, everybody? Hey, uh, I'm recording this right after I finished my Extreme Super Battle Road run, and it looks like we got a enough medals now, I believe. Let's see. Let's see if this will if it'll ever load. Come on, there we go. Yeah, that's enough medals. So we have enough medals now to uh, complete the easy A for this unit. There we go. Let's go ahead and fully awaken them up and get them trained up. And we will take a look at them in a showcase here. I think I might do it on... No, I can't bring them on the new God Goku team, of course, because they're a pure and hybrid Saiyan unit. They don't technically count towards God Goku's leader skill because they're not on either category. Awesome. Um... <laughs> Well, we'll bring them into uh, we'll bring them into an event, probably maybe on Bardock's team. I don't know. We'll see. I'll bring them in on a showcase. We're gonna hop into that uh, in a second. Hey everybody! So we're back here on uh, turn one with this Goku and Gohan. So they do a lot. I'm just gonna show their passive up on screen. You guys can read it. Uh, they do a lot. <laughs> So uh, just, just take a second, pause that, read that, or look it up on the wiki. I'm not going to read that to you. That's too many words. Basically, what you need to know is they get all of their power as the third attacker in the turn. So that's where I'm going to put them. And we're going to do a couple, like, cuts on and off in this video um, uh, with them, like, being, you know, like, since they're going to be a floater, I'm not going to show every turn of this fight. So only the turns that they're on. Uh, we don't have any... We, I brought like a Senzu Bean, but we don't have a support memory up. Uh, so let's go ahead and see what they do here. Oh, uh, let's see. What is their defense at right now? 151k, not bad, actually, because I believe they're stacking on their 12 key. Yeah, and then their um, 18 key, they're also stacking. So yeah, they're stacking on both uh, super attacks. They get some buffs in here for different things. Like I said, that's, that's way too long of a passive. They have some HP recovery. Um, we can do this. I'm not super concerned about them getting, like, a super attack. Um, I, I know it's their showcase, but listen, uh... Mm, it'd be okay if we just uh, never saw them do anything. Are they a support, too? I don't even know. It's so many words. I can't be bothered to... I can't. Listen, I'm sorry. Maybe a younger me would, you know, read their entire passive and know exactly what they do, but I'm 100 years old. I can't be bothered to uh, sit there and read all of that these days. But I will pull it up on the wiki and look at it. Alright. Two key. 59% defense start of turn. Additional 20% defense at the start of each turn up to 59%. Plus an additional defense up uh, 20% up to 59% per Goku ally or Goku family ally attacking in the same turn. Uh, so we will always have that up because it's a full Goku family team under Bardock's leader skill. Uh, by the way, we're going to uh, mute here and... Uh, well, I, I, I'm going to go ahead and mute, actually, and because we're going to have intros playing. So let's go ahead and watch those. You think he will? Place your bets below. Let me know if you think he'll defeat him. Wow, we got a ton of orbs here. Look at that. Thanks, Bardock. Uh, too bad we're only gonna get one attack in here because uh, they didn't they didn't finish this guy off. I was gonna say that while I was muted. You know, they they didn't. I don't think I have like any equips on those guys. They might have like a bronze like level one additional or something. Um, but yeah, they they did take double digits, which I mean this this Shinron like what is he Haze Shinron? He doesn't hit very hard, so I mean. I would hope that they're taking double digits at this point. Let's see. I think I can float off Kid Goku here. I know it looks a little weird with me running this guy in slot one. But, uh, I mean, he's okay defensively. And my goal here isn't really to, uh, like, win. It's just to uh, make it through. I think we're actually going to do this. Yeah, because I need to get those orbs with Kid Goku. I would have liked him to float off and be with that other... Well, I guess this is fine, because then we're going to have the uh, the showcase unit, Goku and Gohan, come back onto this rotation. Oof. He's taking a lot more damage than I thought he would. Yeah. 
Probably should have brought a different slot one unit, but uh, it is what it is, you know. Uh, whenever I was building this team, I was actually going to go up against Broly, but then I decided I wanted to save my Broly fights for the God Goku showcase videos that I'm going to do. So I hopped into here. If we die here, like if he doesn't dodge this and we die... Oh no, 22. Okay. Listen, why... <laughs> of course he doesn't need to dodge it. He's the kid Goku. He takes double digits. Um, but if we die here, I'll just uh, hop back into like this stage or something. There we go. Oh, but Goku, uh, the rest of his passive basically just gets a bunch of attack as, like, the turns go on and as he performs attacks. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not a big deal. He gets a little bit of healing as the third attacker in the turn, so we'll see that at the end of the fight. Oh, hopefully they can, well, I think Beast Gohan hopefully, hopefully can take him out here. Um, I'm gonna get these two with Bardock, because I don't think we're even gonna get to Bardock. But yeah, 180k, not bad. I mean, look, they're keeping on pace with this guy, right? <laughs> No, I don't, I don't actually want to calculate their defense and figure out where they are, but um, they take three turns to build up their defense, I believe. Yeah, three turns to build up their defense. So the next time we see them, they'll have all their um, defense up. The reason I had Gohan attack first is so that he can get his... He has to get, like, what, five attacks in to fully build up? So this is number two. I'm sorry, this is three um, on this turn. It's number two on this turn, number three total. Ooh, sorry, my cord keeps getting stuck on the arm of my chair. I'm afraid it's going to rip out here in a second. Um, so nice. Yeah, we did get that little bit of extra healing at the end of last turn. We can use uh, Kid Goku's active skill. I don't know that I want to do that right now. This should be our... I think we have one more turn with the Scouter up, so I guess he's not supering here. Because we got both Bardocks in turn two, didn't we? <laughs> God, Goku should be fine here. I just want to see if I can kind of clear out some orbs for Kid Goku. I'm trying to think about the best way to do that. Maybe these. And get six. That's good enough. And then... Bardock will be absolutely A-OK -okay here. All right, nice. Uh, so, yeah, so far, I mean... They're not really doing much for us, but they're sitting there at the end. So, even if they don't participate in the turn, right? I believe that them just being in that third turn, at the end of the turn, even if they don't attack... Um, uh, they are healing us 8% HP, so, I mean, at the very least, I can't complain about that. I wish, if I could change anything about this unit, I wish that they were a support unit. Uh, make them like Yajirobe, where, like, you put them in slot 3 and they're giving a 2 turn, like, support buff for being in slot 3. I think that would have been a much smarter way to build this unit. Um, because, like, as it sits right now, I'm not sure what their role is. It's just kind of like a unit that you can put on, like, the third slot on the turn and just hope that they're gonna be okay. <laughs> I don't think they have a 200% right now. Um, just, they're not on many categories. They're only on Joined Forces, Goku's Family, Kamameha, Bond of Parent and Child, Earthbred Fighters. That's all they have. Oh, we can use both of these. Um, what do I want to do? You know what? Let's use theirs. Uh, we'll go ahead and float them off. Or do we? No, we need to get Beast Gohan in attack. It's very important. Let's not use those active skills, actually. I, I really want to, but we need to make sure... Oh, man. this We got horrible key here. This is our last turn with the scatter. Is she just not supering again? I guess so. That's fine. Whatever. We're not going to use the active skills because I need to get Beast Gohan's last uh, two attacks in. I'm afraid. If we use the active skill, we would definitely kill her. Like, that Goku and Gohan would go... They would just wipe her out. So, let's not do that. Nice, Beast Gohan. Nice, so he's fully built up now. It's his fifth attack. It's a rare sighting for me to get this guy fully built up, so I will take that. Hopefully he can show out for us. We will see. You know, I've been told recently that my opinions about him are wrong, so we'll, we'll see. We'll see if I'm wrong. Uh, but, but yeah, back to the Goku and Gohan, the showcase unit. Oh, I you know, I said I was going to cut a bunch in this video, and then I just haven't, so... Uh, if you're still with me, you know, uh, skipping around, trying to find the turns that he's on, you know, whatever, uh, that's fine. I feel like we've been moving through this event, though, at a normal pace, so it's fine. I just, I forgot. <laughs> okay, not bad. We don't have the scouter, though, anymore. We're going to put Goku in slot one. I actually, I kind of want to do this, but they really need to be in, uh, really what I want to do is this, right? So that they can get all in the family, because look, whenever they get all in the family up, yeah, they jump up to like 228k defense, take that away. They jumped down to 190, so. Um, but it's more important, I think, to put 
Kid Goku in slot one so that he can get all of these orbs and give God Goku some damage reduction. Um, yeah, let's get all these orbs because he gets more defense with more orbs that he gets, right? He gets like 7% or something, right? Yeah, per key sphere of 10, he gets 7%. So we will take that and then they can get these green orbs. We should be okay here. Um, I'm not going to use an item. We're just going to see how we do here. Hopefully, what is this is like Oceanus' true form, right? Something like that. I, don't, I can't keep track of all the Shinrons, man. There's too many. But th this is like Oceanus' true form, I believe. Like after she absorbs Pan or something. That's why she can do the Kamehameha. Something like that. I don't know. Let me know. Let me know the GT lore. Because I, I can't be bothered to remember it. You know, it's like, uh, you know, there's a bunch of Shinrons, and then none of them matter until, like, Ice and Nova. And even then, uh, I don't even know if they matter. Okay, so God Goku was taking 90k. I don't, again, I don't know, I, I brought him just, I forgot he was on the team. Uh, I should have brought Carnival Goku instead, the, uh, the tech one. Alright, nice, so they're getting, like, double supers regularly. That's, I mean, that's good, right? We want that with their stacking. Alright, triple super, nice, that's three stacks, very good, I, I... We're getting really good luck with them. They're looking good in this video. Um, still 70k. Not bad, though. And they healed us a little bit. Okay. Um, do we want to use this? I think we do. Now. Now's the time to use Beast Go On. Uh, let's do it. I think. Or do we not? Do we save it? Hmm. Yeah, let's use it. You know, I, I grew up watching the dub, right? I didn't start watching the sub until, like, the Goku Black arc. Um, that, you know, like, that's what got me hooked on, like, uh, sub voice acting. And I gotta say, you know, hearing Goku say special beam cannon instead of MAKANGA SAPPA just doesn't feel right. Like, it, it doesn't, it feels dirty. Also, man, that was not, <laughs> he did no damage. <laughs> it kind of sucked. Um, what do we want to do here? It'd be nice if Bardock got, like, extra orbs with key or something. Uh, we'll put Gohan in front, and hopefully he just kills, uh, Oceanus before we have to deal with it. We'll do this, and then this guy doesn't matter, so. Um, man, that's... Dude, why? Why can't he just... He's fully built up, right? I mean, 9 million, that's not bad. Hopefully he double supers, it's a 70% chance, right? You know? 70%? No, of course not. It's okay, Bardock's gonna come through. Good dodge, though. Love that. Man. <sighs> that's the that's the ultimate Gohan experience, guys. I built him up. Oh, good. Okay, we got the additional. Good. Dude. Hey, you know, he had a less chance to additional there. And, uh... Yeah, we got it. Oh, dude, that... We're probably going to use an item here regardless. Um, I do want to use... Can we use theirs? No, we can't. Hmm. Interesting. Um, we can get a ton of orbs with Kid Goku. It's going to heal us a lot. Let's go ahead and use uh, Kid Goku's active skill. Because then whenever we get the orbs, it'll give us more healing. And then it'll kind of evaluate items from there. Dude, 
why don't I see that on Twitter more? Like, why, why don't people call people a worthless failure of a monster? Why don't they do that? Uh, let's get all these orbs. That's gonna heal us a lot, I believe. Yeah, now we can use their active skill. Perfect. I won't lose! I can't lose! Try this one, Gohan! Yeah. Alright, now that we got some bangers playing, uh, I think we can heal up some more here. Um, we should be okay. We're gonna get the Dokkan attack too, I believe. If not, we're gonna be very close. Yeah, Kid Goku had almost 700k defense with like 30-something percent damage reduction. Um, they're gonna be doing guaranteed crits. We are done with Nova on this turn, or at least we should be. Okay, we didn't get the Dokkan attack. Yep, there's a dodge. Give me one more. Okay, double digits. That's fine. All right, 6.9 million. Uh, we could do three of these. They could all be crits. There's one. Here's two. 7.4 million. Very good. Very powerful unit. Look, hey, uh, Beast Gohan, take notes. This, take notes right here. Yep, there's a crit. All right, and a crit. Now, I'll take it. We got the, we failed the 50% chance for that to be a super, but we still got the crit, so I'll take that. You know, we still did pretty decent damage because then these guys are gonna, gonna come in here and do like a triple crit turn. Yeah, there's five million. Hopefully they get the hidden potential super. Oh, you rat. And we failed that one too. All right. Um, how are they gonna do here defensively? They got two attacks in? Ooh, man. I think we're fine though. Well, no, God Goku's gonna get us killed, isn't he? Oh, my phone's at like 5% battery, guys. We're racing the clock. Look, I'm not lying. <laughs> We're racing the clock here. <laughs> Alright, well, if uh, we die, it's my phone battery. Oh, Molly, my phone battery died, guys. Oh, no. How did that happen? Oh, man. The that's actually, that's, uh, this is the animation that plays when my phone battery dies. Alright, well, uh, I think we got a good look at the Goku and Gohan. Kinda. I mean, th they were doing their thing, just floating around. Um, they weren't looking bad. I don't know that they necessarily provided anything of value to the team, but they did heal us. Um, those heals did keep us a little bit alive. Um, uh, it, it, this is really just my fault. I brought God Goku into an event that you shouldn't bring God Goku into. That's that's on me. Uh, I forgot to adjust the team build to bring Carnival Goku, the, the tech one instead. Anyway, let me know what you guys thought about that Goku and Gohan. Uh, do you think they were worth the... Uh, you know, do you think they were a worthy reward for the Super Battle Road stages or Extreme Super Battle Road? Let me know what you guys think. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video.